Hey Taurus, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your April 1st through the 15th Love and General Tarot reading. I am doing $10 readings now, but let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay, so the card that you guys got is Gates to Hell. Doesn't sound too good. It says, there are three gates that open the way to hell and the degradation of the soul. Lust, anger, and greed. Avoid these three at all costs. O Arjuna. Okay, so this month might be um, testing you guys, okay? Gates to Hell, just straight up, that, that don't sound too good, right? So be careful with um, what you're doing. Um, I also feel like you guys have families or you just, um, there's people that follow you and things like that. Um, make sure the actions that you are doing also benefit the people around you here, okay? I'm also getting to play your cards smart. And just don't get into trouble, right? So let's go ahead and see what your spread is going to say. We have the Nine of Pentacles, Five of Cups reversed, the Lord or the Emperor reversed, the King of Cups reversed. Eight of Wands reversed. The Hermit reversed. Alright, Taurus. So, let's start off with the Nine of Pentacles. Um, the beginning of April, you guys are going to be feeling very solid in who you are, okay? Um, Whatever sadness, regret that you've had, Taurus, um, you're going to get over it. You're going to be looking at your other options. You're going to be hanging out with your friends more, um, just doing things that you like. Um, with the Nine of Pentacles here, you may not have a lot because she's like holding a, a tree branch, right? And there's nothing on the tree branch. There's barely any grass on the floor. Even though you may not have everything you want, I'm getting a sense of individuality. I'm getting a sense of you coming back to yourself and being, like I said, solid in who you are. Um, with the King of Cups right underneath it, you can be male or female. Um, I do see that your emotions are still going to be fucked up a little bit. You may um, overdrink, gamble, overeat, what have you. Okay, so pay attention to that. We have a lot of cards in the reverse, so what this lets me know is um, there's a lot more inner work that needs to be done here. On the outside appearance, it may, you know, look good, but with majority of these cards in the reverse, you need to do inner work. Inner work's not easy. That shit's draining. That shit's hard. Um, with the Lord in the reverse... I feel like you have a lot of options, Taurus. There's a lot of males um around this woman here whether you're male or female i'm sorry but all these males are showing up in the reverse 
like all of them are in the reverse so I'm seeing an Aries I'm seeing a Virgo and I'm seeing a Scorpio Pisces or a Cancer male um, they could be female too having that more masculine energy they're showing up in the reverse and um, they could be talking smack about you too is what I'm getting here um, specifically in a Virgo with Taurus or Aries in their chart they're showing up in the reverse too and the reason why I say talking smack is because we have the eight of wands reversed upright this is free-flowing communication this is networking this is um, you know communication going back and forth everything's smooth when it's in the reverse this talks about hitting a wall this talks about people unfollowing each other on social media, somebody blocking the other person on social media. You may be blocking someone, a Virgo or an Aries or vice versa here. And with this card in the reverse too, this is jealousy, okay? And I feel like people are talking smack and jealous because you're getting over them. You're looking on the bright side, you're coming more into yourself here, your independence. Um, and they don't like that they don't like that because we have the lord the emperor the emperor is controlling when he's in the reverse this is someone narcissistic this is someone controlling this is someone who this person could have had you under their thumb is what i'm getting here they see you getting over them and they don't like it um yeah you may have blocked this person um with the lord in the reverse too some of you guys may feel like you don't have your life together some of you guys feel like you um can't get things in order right now you can't take charge you can't be um, a leader or what have you right now and i feel it's because like I said, with all these cards in the reverse, your inner world needs healing. That shit's not easy. Um, so inner work here to take into consideration um, needs to be had because it is affecting um, your emotional health here, okay? Be careful of a male water sign here. They could be manipulative, but I do see that you are rising above it. So let's go ahead and pull an oracle card of advice for you guys. Sorry about the music, y'all. My phone died. Let's go ahead and see what you got. All right, Taurus, so this says, well, this is peace in the reverse. Now is a time for calmness and well-being in spite of temporary conditions. Even if there are dissonant notes in the music of your life, all that means is that you must go within, what did I say about going within, and fine-tune the extraordinary instruments that you are. Find harmony within yourself and don't look to the outer world to provide certainty. This too shall pass. And once again, your life will be filled with beautiful music. Okay, so that's all I have for you, Taurus. Thank you so much. $10 readings. Check it out. See you guys next time.